Next time your car breaks down, you might expect to pay a few hundred dollars for a fix. But as drivers are keeping their vehicles longer, they're finding those car repair costs keep going up and up and up. Lawrence Douglas was driving home recently when... And my car just died completely when I came off the highway. Zero, just nothing. A local repair shop gave him the bad news. His Kia's alternator had failed. Well, his actual alternator part. His bad day got even worse when they handed him the bill. A new battery? $204. New alternator? $902. Total? $1,846.14 for a battery and alternator and labor. Almost two grand. July inflation data shows the cost of vehicle maintenance and servicing is up nearly 9% since last year. Worse, vehicle repairs are up 19.5%, six times the rate of inflation. Mark Duber owns an auto repair shop. He says his costs are up sharply, with the price of some parts doubling since the pandemic. Plus, he has to pay more to get certified mechanics. Hard to find technicians. And then with a the shortage, of course, you got to pay guys more. Drivers are also trying to avoid new car prices. So there is more pain on the repair and maintenance side, but not nearly as much as there is on the purchase side. So what are your options for managing repair costs? Consumers Checkbook says if the work isn't covered by a warranty, try an independent shop over a dealer. Get several estimates. Even if you're charged, you may save by finding a lower price. And get repairs done quickly before damage gets worse. Lawrence Douglas says he won't be able to afford the next $1,800 repair. I just don't know what to do anymore. As always, don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.